when I bought this business, it was not as you see it today. It was white walls and concrete floors and shop lights for lighting. I love it and transformed it. It's got great energy. We have great stylists. We meet wonderful people and we have tons of fun. So I wouldn't do anything else. I really wouldn't. Uh, Castle Pines is special for us. When we first came to visit the location, when we were looking for a place to come, we saw that the community was on a needle Mexican restaurant. So my first feeling was that this was the right place to come. Castle Pines was formed as a housing development approximately 25 years ago, a little bit more than that, and has grown to be probably about three or four times the size that it was originally envisioned. And we've emerged as a very vibrant, thriving community. Uh, it is a great place to live from the types of things that anyone would come to Colorado for. We're close to a lot of the great things of Colorado, but we don't have to go very far. Daniels Park is a buffalo reserve. It has been around for generations. The buffalo. Castle Pines has 40 in their herd, and there's Big Daddy. He'll come down, and then the rest of the herd will come down. We also have the views of Pikes Peak to Mount Evans. People go up to, there to have picnics, to hike, to walk, and spend time with their families. We laugh. We get together in our cul-de-sacs. We walk together, have our dogs meet up at the park together. We really have a special connect. Local businesses provide so many services so that you don't have to drive far to get what you need. Despite the fact that we have a, a relatively small shopping center with about 70 businesses total, many of which are local, there are probably somewhere around 300 to 400 people employed in these areas. That's a lot of people. So local business is a very strong thing, plus it helps us create our own local economy.